Hi there, I'm just going to take us for a walk around this 120 amp hour BMW i3. It's a 120 amp hour i3, which in normal terms that equates to about a 42 kilowatt hour battery. Uh, in this super efficient lightweight car, that's going to give you about 180 miles worth of driving range, depending on the time of year and your preferred driving style. Uh, namely, how fast you like to drive, because obviously this is a BMW i3, uh, which means it's a really, really fun little car to drive. Um, other stats on this particular car, um, it's done 43,500 miles, so yeah, nice sort of medium mileage, but that, that's a good thing that gets this car down to a very, very appealing sort of price point. Uh, next MOT is not due till middle of June next year, and next service isn't due until June the year after. So yeah, nothing to worry about on this car for absolutely ages. And it's a really nice looking car. Uh, the imperial blue with the grey and silver accents I think looks really nice and stylish. Um, generally it's in really good condition. Um, just a couple of minor little marks uh, on the car which I will point out to you now as I go around. There's a little bit of um, sort of door nibble on the side of the door. It's obviously caught on something, it's all touched in, so it's not really very noticeable, but um, that is there. I'd say that's probably the most noticeable thing on the car. Uh, and obviously it's a fairly minor thing. There's some light scratchiness on the boot sill and a few chips. Obviously the boot's been sort of well used. Um, this is very typical of i3s. Um, it's paint on plastic and it's the same load, load height as the interior of the boot. So they do tend to get a bit scratchy as you can see, but yeah, nothing particularly untoward. I would say that's um, definitely average for a BMW i3. Um, now it's, oh yeah, so there's a, a very, there's a light little scratch there on the uh, passenger side door. I'm not even sure if you can see that, but there's a little light scratch there. Um, and I feel silly pointing this out, but there's the tiniest, lightest little bit of marking on this front alloy. But to be fair, that isn't really a thing. Um, so there's the odd a little stone chip or two um, on the bonnet, mainly. Nothing particularly major. So there's done 40 odd thousand miles, so uh, a few little stone chips is uh, inevitable. Uh, but that's it. I mean, overall, it's a really nice condition car. Looks really nice. Just a couple of minor little, minor little marks. Uh, Interior-wise, it's all good. Um, Spec-wise, in terms of upgrades, this car's got comfort access, so that's uh, keyless entry, if you like. So obviously, all they've got keyless starting. Got this nice big infotainment system uh, as well. You've got cruise control, speed limiter. Um, really nice iDrive system, um, but ultimately the, I think where the value lies in the i3 is its drive. Uh, in my opinion, there isn't a nicer EV to drive. This is what I'm driving myself at the moment. Yeah, nice condition inside as you can see. To be thorough, I'm going to pop open the boot as well. Um, I think the boot in the i3 is actually surprisingly good. Um, with the seats folded down, you've got a really nice big volumeless load space in its normal state. It's ideal for what you carry around on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, we'll also be supplying this car, like we do all our cars, with a three-pin charging lead. So it'll come with a lead that you can just plug into a, you know, like any normal 240 volt main socket, uh, and you can charge the car from that. So you don't necessarily even need to get a charge point installed. Uh, and there you have it. If you're looking for a 120 amp hour BMW i3 at a very appealing price point and in good condition, um, this could well be the car for you. Uh, but it's here on the forecourt, ready for a test drive reviewing. Uh, alternatively, we'll deliver this car to your home if you want. Um, please be sure to check out our um, BMW i3 videos on our website and our YouTube channel. Hopefully you'll find those videos useful. And thank you very much for watching. Hopefully speak to you soon.